Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a small haul for you guys. It's from Zayt Bath. The owner's name is Ashley. Um, and this was from her May 19th restock. I wasn't gonna buy anything for this restock cause I was kind of running a baby shower and the baby shower started at two, the restock was at three. I kind of just already had it set in my mind that I wasn't gonna get anything. But of course, as the waxaholic that I am, I still tried, right? But when I got on there, I um, what I wanted was pretty much sold out, uh, which was the wax scoops that you see here. But the reason why you still see them here is because later on that evening, she was like, woo, those things flew off the shelf. How about we do a pre-order? And that's what she did. And because she did the pre-order, I was able to get the wax scoops. And because I wanted to make my shipping worthwhile, I went ahead and got more stuff, right? Um, so, but this is still fairly small and this is still kind of aiding to my low buy. So, um, six items, I think that's pretty good, especially if this, uh, compared to my last restock, right? Um, from Zape, my last order from her last restock. Anyway, so without further ado, we'll go ahead and just start with the sample, and this is Hustle and Grace. It's just that she always provides one sample um, with her orders. I wish you guys would have, I wish I would have opened it because I was showing it to my mom, and um, I went ahead and opened it, took out, out all the paper and everything like that, but this paper was so pretty. It had like the little roses, and it was just so pretty, and I strategically took that paper and um, the sticker on it and everything it did not rip at all and I will be gifting somebody <laughs> that so anyway this is just a sample it's hustle and grace it smells very fruital and with a hint of floral I don't know the um, it smells fruity with a hint of floral I don't know um, what the whole scent description is it could probably have some type of creaminess in it as well so kind of like a creamy, fruity, floral scent. Like only just a hint of floral, but I don't know what the scent description is. So samples, I like to be able to try, you know, one thing. So I appreciate that. Um, so onto the order, I got these cute little rabbits. Are these not the cutest things? And so you guys know I'm just been, I've just been obsessed with like coffee scents and things like that. So this one is Cappuccino Pizzell. It's vanilla waffle cookies with toasted marshmallow and, mar and espresso. Now, I don't know if she put it in that order for a reason. Like, I wonder if she puts it in the order of like, what's more more of the prominent note in the scent or if, if she just puts it in there like with no rhyme or reason. But her coffee is like probably my favorite coffee scent. However, with this scent blend itself, it's a little sweet. Probably from that toasted marshmallow. I will say the brown part of this smells more of like these, the coffee. Yeah. The white part doesn't really not smell like coffee, but the brown, smell, the brown part really smells like coffee. I don't know if that's accurate or not. So anyway, this one smells really, really good. It's just a little sweeter than I think her other coffee scents are. And so I, I'm very curious how that's going to melt. And my nose senses might be a little off, but I think this one is a bit sweeter than the other coffee scents that she has. So, but I really like it. Um, I plan on using it. Definitely not something I'm going to de -stash. Um, but it's just not, it's just that I don't, I'm not feeling it on cold as much as I feel all her other coffee scents. Put it like that. So the next one is Sticky Fingers. It's vanilla wafer cookies. Hey, does that one have vanilla wafer cookies in it too? Oh, she's just been coming out with the vanilla wafer cookies oil from the, <laughs> cause I got another one with vanilla wafer cookies. Anyway, this is Sticky Fingers, vanilla wafer cookies, and sticky buns. And this is the cutest, the cute shape that I really, 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 really like. So this one, I wasn't sure how it was going to smell, but it smells very cinnamony, and you guys know how I feel about cinnamon. And it's uh, it's not as bad right now, so hopefully when I melt it, it's going to be like perfect, like that cinnamon sugar. But right now, it's pretty heavy on the cinnamon. From cold, it's pretty heavy on the cinnamon, which I was not expect it. I don't even know what a sticky bun is. Is that like a cinnamon roll or what? I don't know because that's what it smells like. It smells like a cinnamon bun. So yeah. Um, I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. Yet. Um, this next one is 
under the boardwalk. It's funnel cake, cotton candy, vanilla, caramel corn, and beach grass. This one was like, I think all of these were kind of, except for the coffee blend, these are kind of like me stepping out on not really knowing because these aren't normally, I'm not really a caramel person. I'm, I'm not really a popcorn person when it comes to scented, like wax and stuff like that. And I'm not normally a beach grass person. And this one's just different. You get a lot of the cotton candy and funnel cake. Um, this is the caramel corn. There's caramel. I don't know if it's caramel corn that I'm smelling, but I smell caramel, you know, by itself. And I get a little bit of the beach grass. So this is a really different type of scent. Very, very different. Um, so I'm just curious to know what that what this is going to smell like melted because it's just so different It's really kind of hard to explain actually so um, That's that so the next thing I got was the three uh, Wax scoops and that's really what I wanted and she does provide like these little um, wooden spoons which I really appreciate because I don't really want to use my my own actual dishes like I have a wax cutter but I might have to go get like a, I don't know, like something to scoop my wax with. Because I don't want to, like, I mean, I could designate a knife or a spoon to my wax. But I want it to be significantly significantly different than my other spoons and knives. Anyway, so this next one is Drop of Sunshine. This one's a super popular one. What is that? Is that wax? Anyway, um, this one's a super popular scent. It's tangy lemon curd and vanilla wafer cookies. And I no, don't normally gravitate towards lemon curd or lemon type of scents unless it's like a cleaner lemon that like like super clean or kind of sweet, sweet lemon or something like that. But lemon bakery is just not my jam. But people were raving about this in body care. And I was like, let me get it. Let me try it. Even though this is going against my better judgment. <laughs> and um, I think, and it's not that I think that Lemon Bakery stinks. It's just not my thing, you know. It's just not my, that's not my, my type of scent, you know. You know my scents, like, so. And that's what it smells like. It smells like a lemon cake or something. Um, so wondering if when I melt it, if the vanilla wafer cookies come out a little bit more. Because right now I'm just smelling like a lemon bakery. And so I don't know because she just poured these because it was a pre-order since she just poured it. I don't know what I, how much time I need to cure it. I think that she says like for the other, like for the re ready to ship, like once you get it, it's ready to melt but we'll just see it's not stinky at all it's not that i hate it it's not that i don't like it. it's just not my type of scent and so i just keep smelling it wanting to love it but it's just that lemon bakery that i just from any vendor i've just never been into um uh beach toes it's vanilla coconut tan lines and sunshine so this is a combination of her beach bound and toes in the sand and um this i like i really love her beach balm because it reminds me of suntan from bath and body works and i love that candle oh my gosh i love that candle especially during the summer time like such a good candle uh this one's good the coconut you know coconut always throws me off a little bit but i think i'm able to deal with it when it's in a suntan type of blend so yeah it's pretty good that coconut really <laughs> it really throws me off just a little bit and i don't think that uh coconut is in beach bound i think that coconut is only in toes in the sand so i think like toes in the sand is like coconut and tan lines or something like that i don't know but yeah it's a good scent it's what I wanted, and so I'm ready to melt it and then also burn my suntan candle and just be in, you know, a summer bliss. 
This next one is strawberry short nuts. It's strawberry shortcake and glazed donuts. I love the name of this. Like, I just love, I love Ashley. This one's good. Her strawberry is unlike any other vendor strawberry. It is not the same. And at first, I did not like it. I was like, what is this? Because I was comparing it to other vendors. But once it started mel melting the stuff that I was getting, like, I love Tilt a Whirl. I love that scent. Um, I really love Mr. President. Um, and I, I like the, um, the, what is it? Uh, what is that one scent? But it has coconut, strawberry. It was on the website. California Girl is what it is. I really like that one. It's the coconut kind of, you know, makes me only like it and not love it. But her strawberry is just like no other. It smells so good. So I'm happy I got that one. I'm hoping that the glazed donuts does come out a little bit more while melting. But right now, I just really like that one because I like her strawberry. It's pretty good. Um, so that is my haul. This is a small, um, I'm hoping to stick with my small hauls like this. So if I buy, I'll buy just a little bit and not too much. Now I did make a recent purchase from another vendor that I kind of went ham, like ham, like pork, like Charlotte's web crazy. Okay. So, um, anyway, but you'll see that soon. Um, but that vendor is she's retiring and she's closing her shop. So, you know, I had to do what I had to do Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I will chat with you guys in a later video. Bye guys